Alright everybody, so today we're going to be reacting uh, to this dude that uh, is apparently in love with this car. And I don't mean in love with this car, like, you know, when you, you, when you like, see it like for the first time, you're like, oh, I, I love this, you know, it's, it's going to be my car forever. No, 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 no. He, he is in love with his car. And when I mean in love with his car, I mean sexually attracted to his car. His car's name is Chase. I, I don't know what the guy's name is, um, because I haven't watched this video in a while, but I want to react to it again, because I don't really remember s a lot of it. So this is going to be really, really fun um, to react to, so do me a favor, guys, and drop a like, subscribe, and turn on notifications. Um, I'll leave the original video down in the description below. With that being said, uh, let's get right into the video. Alright, alright, you can already tell just by looking where he lives is that a lot of people have, uh, sex with their cars or just fetishes with, uh, balloons. My name is Nathaniel, I'm 27 years old, and I'm in a serious relationship with my car. Bro, what the frick is that, dude? Morning, baby. Okay, did you guys hear that? He said, morning baby, to his car. Morning baby, morning baby, morning baby, morning baby, morning baby. Like, how, how do you have sex with your car? Like, like, I do not get that. Like, I know you can make out with your car, you can kiss it. And like, like, that, that's possible, right? That, that's possible, but it's still fucking weird. But if you want to have sex with your car, like... Like, oh my god, okay, like, what do you, where do you stick it, okay, where do you stick it, like, in, in the fucking tire, like, what, like, okay, like, <laughs> this is hilarious to me, just, just because, it, it, all these strange addictions are so fucking hilarious, I just, I love to make fun of them so much, so, I, keep doing this, guys, so, can someone get sexually attracted to, uh, to their feet next, like, their own feet next, so I can make fun of it? Um, that would be, that would be really amazing. Or somebody, can someone get sexually attracted to a Funko Pop or, or something, please? I would love to make fun of that so much. Just please, please guys, just, I'm begging you. Nathaniel is in a committed relationship with a car that he's named Chase. Oh, I couldn't have guessed. I thought they were just friends with benefits. He met Chase in a resale lot about five years ago. Love you, baby. It was love at first sight. His body and then his interior and everything just together just seemed to fit. And I just felt an instant connection. See, normal people have a, let's say, for example, story like, like, oh, I met, uh, oh, I met this girl at a, at, at, in high school or something. But no, 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 no. This man right here has, <laughs> he met, he met his car at a, what, what was it again? What was it again? Can can someone play the clip, please? Met Chase in a resale lot. Yeah, it, yeah, that that. Like he met his car. That I I'm sorry, but I, yeah, that that is really fucking fun. Nathaniel's obsession first developed as a teenager when he would build model cars, but he didn't find true love until he met Chase. I find this part of him the most sexy, just because the subtle lines and curves. Yeah, man, that is so sexy. I just want to freaking ugh. I'll give him a kiss here, and just kind of caress him down the side. My initial reaction was, I was kind of shocked. It was kind of weird because it was just hard to understand. You can tell that the woman there is just trying not to say anything mean. Like, she's just like, oh, it's just, it's just hard to understand. Like, like, no, if there's no limitations, I bet she'll be like, that is f weird to have sex with your car you should go to a mental hospital like you know what i mean object whatever is when a person develops a strong emotional and sexual relationship with an inanimate object yeah guys you see that roller coaster over there i want to ride it honestly I, I don't know why i feel the way i do but i just absolutely love chase we always have such a good time together he likes a lot of the same music I do. Dang, bro, I didn't know a car likes the same music as you. Alright, now here comes the part, and the part is a clear, clear, disgusting act. So, I warn you, if you are sensitive uh, to, uh, for example, penises, uh, cars getting banged, um... A weird man's voice, uh, a kid named Nathaniel, glasses, mustache, 
um, facial hair, uh, pubic hair, then I suggest you do not watch this clip or just skip ahead, leave a like, and say bye to the video, okay? So I just, I warn you. We have our times when we get sexual. Does that feel good? You're a handsome man. Love you, baby. Dude, bro, you best nut ever! Alright, so, um, if you enjoyed the video somehow, um, I would appreciate it if you smack the like button, um, right across its face. If you don't, I will personally come to your house and, um, give you a free signed basketball. Yeah, that's right, guys. Um, no, but, uh, but all seriousness, though, oh, oh I can't speak. All seriousness, though, um... Make sure you guys drop a like, subscribe, uh, turn on notifications. I hope you guys did enjoy this video, because if you did, you know, do what I just said, like, two, three sec- 15 seconds ago. I love you guys so much. If you guys want to see more of these videos, make sure you guys, uh, do what I said 30 seconds ago. Um, uh, that, that means you drop a like. Um, and yeah, um, I will- I keep saying um. See you guys in the next video. Peace.